many lifetimes ago. An object of incredible wonder, the Tube of Gaia, used its limitless power to create all life. It spun a world of limitless beauty and artistry, a masterpiece for all who dwelt there. Bred from this land of wonder were numerous creatures and cultures. The Cube of Gaia, whatever its true purpose, selected some of the citizens of the world to be the holders of a strange power. They were given the ability to command the sacred beasts known as Eidolons. The cube simply granted this power. It did not control how it was used. Those with darkness in their hearts used the Eidolons to commit crimes and atrocities. Those with noble hearts used the Eidolons to aid their selfless acts of bravery. To this day, no one can be certain of the cube of Gaia's intentions. But the people chosen by the cube have written the history of this land with their exploits. Those chosen, whether they acted for good or ill, are known by a common name. Envoy of Gaia. Waffles here, and I'm with. Um, and with a guy, this is Mario 65. And we're gonna sit here for a minute to explain our absence. Honestly, this is more my fault than hers this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this time? Hey, there's a lot of occasions in the past where we didn't record because you you weren't available. <laughs> oh yeah, true. Yeah, but this time, guys, it was my end. Our, uh, landlady got divorced, and her, uh, ex wanted, uh, money from the house sale, so we had to get the F out. And we ended up in a hotel for quite a considerable amount of time. And before that happened, my computer's hard drive completely died, so I couldn't use it. So even when we moved in here, I couldn't do anything for a little while. <laughs> and the worst part about that, guys, is all of my stuff for you too was the hard drive that died. <laughs> and so if you take a look at her character, you can see he's level 11. This is because we attempted yeah. to do this redo before my computer hard drive bit the dust. Yeah, wasn't it like a day or two before it bit the dust? Yeah, like a day or so after we recorded, and I finished editing everything, and I was too tired to upload it. So you guys can imagine, I felt so regretful at that point. <laughs> <coughs> I was so sad. We put so much effort into that. <laughs> yeah, we put way too much. We even did a lore video for you guys. <laughs> we'll have to do that again, too. <laughs> It won't be too bad. Yeah, and hey, if we need help, we, we have the thing is in the dock still, so. <laughs> well, we don't really gotta worry too much on that, and because I pretty much remember everything about Port Scandia. Yeah, plus we're about to run through here again, so it's fine. Yeah. And hey, before you guys see this video, there's gonna be an extra video you get to see. <laughs> Which uh -oh. hopefully won't take too much editing to work with. Remember the screenshots we took? Well, you took. I couldn't oh, get right. <laughs> I wasn't able to. Yeah. Because <laughs> I had to remake this character so we could do this. I spared yeah. her remaking her character though. She should be really cool. <laughs> yeah, I, I was completely against redoing my character. <laughs> I took pity on her though and didn't make her do it. Yeah, I mean, I've already spent LP on him. It's very dark. 
I was not going through all that again. There we go, this is better. Hi guys! <laughs> <laughs> My room is getting dark. Alright, so let's get into this now, everybody. Dang, put your lance away, you don't need it. I like to pants for a second for some other reason. <laughs> when I go a certain way, I mean, he does have a no lance that's in his pants. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but as we go through the game, guys, we'll explain things as they come up, because last time we kind of just talked about it and did not like it, and that wasn't particularly good to do, and it bothered me later down the line. What, talking about the areas as we go through them? As tutorials come up and such. Huh. Yeah, because we were jumping ahead. The game has tutorials in it. And sure, they can be a little lacking or confusing, which case is where we step in. <laughs> yep. And also, we understand a few more things about the game now, so we can explain, whoa, other stuff. Huh. I feel like my lights just flicker. <coughs> There's a demon nearby. Oh, don't you even. <laughs> Sorry, supernatural hit right there. I'm gonna turn that off just in case the sound needs to play again. I don't want to get sued. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, I lost my train of thought. Okay, I was talking about how we will only discuss tutorials as they come up, and we would explain things that the game sort of fails to. Oh yes, and the very important part, which is going to take us a little bit of work, possibly. As soon as we're done with each area in the game, Maria and I will work on doing a lore video for them to explain the, what happened in the area in the past and what exactly is going on at this point in time. That way it's easier to understand. Yes. And it is yeah. interesting, especially when you get further in. Yeah, once you hit about level 30 to level 40 is when the storyline really starts to pick up. But as we go further in, I'll explain a little bit more, cause, and you'll you'll see why it gets a bit more interesting. Yeah. I'm not going to say anything in the early videos to kind of spoil it, because then what's the point of watching the later videos? Yeah, and hey, some people <laughs> only watch a playthrough or walkthrough to see if they like the game. <laughs> I don't like that, anyway. Yeah! Also, I will apologize a little bit if I kind of do a lot of coughing or clearing my throat. I got something stuck in the back of my throat. <clears throat> yeah, you've been sick. don't really know what it is. Everybody cut Maria some slack. These things happen. <coughs> and we will explain the reasons for our characters' names and why we were why they remain at the end of the video. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna talk about it now, I guess. It is funny. <laughs> yeah, well, go ahead and explain it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, me and Maria have a running joke. <laughs> is that if she was a dude, I totally would have dated her. <laughs> yeah, so, if I was a my dude, character's based off she... of legit me, and her character is basically a male version of her. <laughs> yeah, except for the hair and eyes, because sadly I don't have yellow eyes, but I mean, <laughs> having gold eyes would be great. I think it used to be an eye color, it just died out. That might have been just a rumor I heard, though. It, it would be possible. <laughs> yeah, I mean, having as blue eyes is the... considered to be a mutation. <laughs> yeah, as for the, uh... As for the black hair, I constantly dyed my hair black when I was about 18 years old because <laughs> I thought black hair was cool. So, it is and pretty. then pre and pretty much right after I dyed it black, it stayed. Uh, after like a few weeks, the color washed away, and I was left with dirty blonde hair that had black streaks at the roots. <laughs> it never left. <laughs> it liked you. <laughs> 
Yeah, the black streaks just never left. I was left with dirty blonde hair that went from like black at the roots, dark brown, brown, light brown, dirty blonde, gold, <laughs> gold tips at my hair. And I was just kind of like, eh, this works. <coughs> also, you guys read the dialogue I, again. I was actually thinking about this myself, uh, Minna, but I was thinking of doing a video on Eidolons. In case anyone wants to like know about an Eidolon or something, we could we could do a video about the Eidolons in a way. We don't have to have the Eidolons, but we could just talk about them. Okay, like, that goes in turn with are. the game tutorials, you know. No, like what an Eidolon's specialties are what they're mainly good at. Like, are they good at defense? Are they good at offense? Are they good at magic? Stuff like that. That's actually easy, easily solved just playing through the game, but sure. Well, it's in case someone wants to know what an idol is like before they try to get it. Of course, sure. we can explain- we can talk about that at a later date. I mean, it's like, with me, I only want to get Eidolons I, I know are going to be useful to me. The game gives you a bunch for free, and trust me, they are good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But there are some like, I won't bother certain, to get a hold of. I, yeah, there's, I, there's a lot of Eidolons I really like. And there are some I get just because I want them. <laughs> Like Dao Yeah, Jan. I mean, She's I'm so pretty pretty. sure. I don't know if we, I don't know if we still have any of those videos up, but the videos with Insidiana. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I once heard me fangirl about Alucard. Well, I'm only <laughs> going to keep a couple of the old videos, the ones where I broke you in. So. Yeah, guys, I don't recommend you buy weapons and armor at stores unless you absolutely have to. Because you're going to get better stuff from rocks from monsters. Or if yeah, you have money at a later date, you can buy it from other people. Or trade. That too. Okay. Instances and fishing are where you'll definitely be getting better equipment. Yeah, and also... There's supposed to be speed bubbles above these people's heads, like these NPCs here. But I've already collected them, so they're not showing up. Yeah. They're, they're all pretty funny. Uh, especially when you meet characters later on called Romeo and Juliet. Oh gosh. Oh my god. I considered they that cheesy and gag worthy. They, they are stickingly mushy and romantic, and I'm just kind of like, dear god. They're gag worthy. They are. <laughs> that guy's never gonna sell his produce here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't care how good your vegetable is or how you grew it, I ain't buying it, son. <laughs> F you. <laughs> yeah. That's ridiculous. Hello. We are returning. Oh! oh. Alucard's here as of this. Well, academic Alucard, but still Alucard. Did you only just now notice that he's been there for ages? <laughs> oh, I noticed that, but I mean, I mean, Alucard. I can't help it. <laughs> yeah, I expected that. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I have him on one of my other characters. I've got him too. Hello, Dragon King. Hello, Dragon. King. There's something I said in our last attempt at redoing this, and probably in the main, in the original playthrough, but I'll say that again in a minute. I'll let the game reach that point first before I say anything. Okay. Yay, we're errand runners! Well, that's basically what our job entails. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much what we've been this whole time. Yeah. God, they were calling us a garrison member. Did you guys read that? I gave you plenty of time to pause the video, so don't you dare say you did. <laughs> <laughs> and from what Maria's told me, garrison member's basically just someone who does odd jobs. Right? 
Yeah. They do our jobs and protect the uh protect the town. Yep. So our character's actually pretty important to the area. <laughs> <laughs> Lot of unrest in the world right now, apparently. Oh yeah. I'm delivering your lunch to being paid to. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I wouldn't be that blunt I'm about it. Your meal. <laughs> I'm delivering your meals because your wife has to look after the kids. <laughs> okay, this is where I wanted to say this, guys. This is a small fishing village or town, however you want to say it. If someone goes missing, be worried, because this is a small place. Everyone knows everyone, there shouldn't be something to happen at such a small area. Exactly, so he should be way more concerned than that. But He's too laid back. But they also remember, the way they talk about it makes it seem like the guy who's missing is a slacker and that it happens often. He's talking about his son. Just... Oh. I you're thinking you're the wrong person, guys. Man. My bad. <laughs> ah, yes, this guy. I actually like him. <laughs> I don't have a problem with him at all. <laughs> Who? Uh, uh, Kane? Is that how you pronounce his name? The guy with the C? Not the K? Aw, uh, Kane? Yes. Whereas I like to call him Kyan, because there's another person in the town called Kane. Which is why I was hesitant when I was saying his name. <laughs> Let's call him Kyan. Hey guys, check out my starting outfit, isn't it cute? <laughs> However, I would so never wear this in real life. It's too short. <laughs> and it's also very much pink. I ain't the biggest fan of the color. <laughs> Hey look, I'm one of these guys. Hi there! I'll leave a link in the description to someone on YouTube who found all of these, cause I had to look at their guide to find them all myself. Oh. I didn't know where all these were. Some of them were in areas I never went to, so yeah. Understandable. Of course there's other ways to cook a fish, you dip. <laughs> oh my gosh! Don't you have a cookbook? Sorry. <laughs> Someone tells me that most of them just kind of don't care. Possibly. Although I would get sick of eating something the same way all the time. Yeah. Those flowers look puffier than they used to. That's cool. <laughs> and if you guys remembered that opening scene, it wasn't so animated before. <laughs> <laughs> They've been doing upgrades, man. <laughs> there he yep. is. Hey, Pally. I'm here for work. <laughs> um, okay, there we go. <laughs> it's like, hi, Kai. Ryan? Nope, haven't heard him. Or seen him, in fact. <coughs> right, I will work right away. <laughs> <laughs> I won't want to pick up rabbit duty either. <laughs> If you don't know where something is, guys, this, as this tells you, just click on these. It's very helpful. Also, put your potions on this, and then push on. You will automatically use the potion this way. You won't have to click on it or anything. And I didn't know that for the longest time. Boy, would that have been useful a long time ago. <laughs> I forgot to grab my Yoshi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Okay, I know I had four in the bottom two and two in the top, so that's fine. I have that mostly memorized. Uh -huh. I'm just doing my stats, that's all. Ah! Alright. Die! Die! <laughs> I almost always yeah. forget there's an extra one. Cause you only gotta kill three of these guys. Yeah, that's because the mysterious bunny hops are stronger than the normal ones. Yeah, it makes sense. Alright, now, just like last time, I'm gonna edit this part out because I'm gonna grind a little bit on these guys to get an extra level. Trust me, guys, Alrighty. it's gonna be helpful. <laughs> This part out. Well, that's gonna be fun since my editing software effing lags. I wonder why it does that. Ah! Sorry, I <laughs> spotted my daring dragon out. I noticed. <laughs> Start off. What the? You didn't die in one hit? Bad. Okay, the first thing you guys should ever do in Envoy's Pass, and this I didn't know, and ended up spending a lot of money to redo my Envoy Pass with my original character several who knows how many times, is quick study. You want to get every single one of these first. It will help you level up faster, and it definitely helps in the later levels. Yes. Oh, we're at 30 minutes, which means this video has to end real quick. Well, actually, the way we do this is special. So, here, you stay there and wave at the camera with me, or bow. Yeah, well, that's it. Alright, so we will see you guys in the next video, which will be up tomorrow. Bye! Yep! <laughs>